What's the best goal you've ever seen on Football Manager? Because today we're going to try and beat it. We have put out the inaugural call for the Football Manager Puskis Award. And by the inaugural call, I mean a tweet. I mean, seriously, what'd you expect from me? I'm going to get a giant stage like FIFA and spend an hour with a bunch of concerts by Shakira before I tell you who actually wins the Puskis Award? No, we're going to tweet about it and you're going to send your best goals ever scored and of course now that you're watching this video you're thinking i have one well this was your fault you didn't follow me on twitter but there are a bunch of people that did reply with the best goal they have ever seen on football manager they have a recording of it and we're gonna watch it and decide for ourselves which one is the best goal on football manager this year dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. look at that handsome man right there look at that right there look at that. All right, we have Jamie Dunn scored in a Bulgarian League Network save. Probably the best goal I've seen from a man with around 10 finishing and long shots. So let's have a look. Ooh I thought it was going to be the free kick. I was like, oh, there's no way. It, oh, oh, Dimitar Tazvradzade. <laughs> I mean, that's from significant distance can't beat an on league wonder strike in le philippe cup i got my need headphones for this one bring it back I, I hope i'm wrong so i'd love to <laughs> this. Holy what the did you what i mean that is i mean that that's actually that's the new best one connor riddle's strike is the is the new best one marcel a first touch and shot so ridiculous he almost makes it look easy here we go Stop it. Stop it. Oh, th this is beautiful. This, this deserves an FM Puskas Award because not only is it a beautiful goal, it's got football manager written all over it. Goalkeeper clearance touched down brilliantly, volleyed over Berlito, no problem. Sick goal. That one right there is absolutely our new favorite. That That is crazy. I have a late submission for the Puskas Award. Surely this takes it home. Okay. Gomez. Just shoot He's it. Out Just us. shooting it. Oh, that's it's a really nice goal. Oh my Joe god. Joe Thromez. You know what this reminds me of? Is something Rudiger would do. He's sprinting at us. It's a really nice goal. It's a really nice goal. It's not better than the one that, that we saw from Marcel here. Why we have Chris when you play with a sweeper keeper on attack? Gotta love a handheld film. Oh no. I mean, look, it's not. <laughs> It's not a world beating goal. It's not. Our other one was cooler, man. Next, we have Josh Dinby. Josh, take it away. Oh. I'll watch that again. I'll watch that again. He hits that ball and it is going out for a throw if it does not bend. <laughs> That's tough. I'm still staying with Marcel's goal right now. I'm staying with Marcel's goal right now, but that, that is nasty. I don't know if I've ever seen a goal that looked quite like that. My center defensive midfielder will take the aware. Thank you. I believe they meant the award, but okay. If you want to win the award, don't film it with your phone on your computer. Record it on your computer so that you can actually see what's going on. That being said, this is a sick goal. It's a sick goal. Kind of broke physics. You got the whole side foot all of a sudden able to generate that kind of power. Literally just scored this, says Danny. Well, let's take a look. What did we just score? I mean, honestly, congrats on Loris Karius for getting himself back into a top league. He's really showing out. So said this is an absolute thunderbolt from his left back. <laughs> That's, that's an unbelievable goal. I mean, really, that is absolutely, I mean, it's from so far away. It makes no sense in the laws of physics. And yet I feel compelled to say this is just the best goal we've seen. It's from so preposterously far away. From Grigwol on FC Andorra. But there's no way. There's no way this isn't the best goal we've seen. I mean, it's like a 40 yard volley. So we have a new favorite. It is the goal from Matt Cheeseman, which nice, nice name. The greatest football manager goal ever. People digging into their Snapchats for these. Hit it. 
This is going to be a tight debate. This is really similar to the last one, but the last one was farther away, but this one was objectively hotter. It was smokier. It was steamier. I mean, this is wicked. Scissor kick outside the by, you know, 30 yards away right in the top corner. I really hope there's a one that's better than both of those so I don't have to make a decision because I don't want to have to choose between those two right now. My left back shot was so powerful, the ball went through the net. <laughs> I was hoping it was going to get counted as a goal. It's a solid hit by Ryan Bertrand. All right, here's the next goal. Oh. Oh. This is actually the best I've seen football manager look. Right, that volley looks completely physically accurate. It's nasty. That is, oh. Catches the keeper unaware that it, it's not the best one we've seen, but it's the best looking one on Football Manager. I'll give it that, Alvar. And speaking of the best looking one, check, no, not me. You might've noticed we got a new chair. Now this is courtesy of a company called Costway, and you can get this chair for yourself at a discount with the link down in the description. It is remarkably comfortable. Here, let me take you on a tour. First of all, you have this lovely neck rest that comes in very breathable of course these holes that make you look like you're driving some sort of motor vehicle but then as we go lower you see we've got this lower back rest as well which slides around you can put it wherever your lower back happens to be it's incredibly comfortable that's not all because it also comes with a leg rest which you can put away and these things snap around and the chair is incredibly breathable and incredibly comfortable and it's just one of many things the Costaway makes. They make goods for all around the home. So if you need absolutely anything that's going to be built well and something that's going to be comfortable to sit on, if it's something that you're going to need to be able to sit on, because I can attest, it's comfortable to sit on. I sit in this chair about 12 hours a day and I don't feel a thing. You can actually even crack your back on this. It's a spiritual experience. You can get whatever you want for any part of your home or your apartment. You just scroll through and you shop by room right here and it ships ridiculously fast. I got this chair like a day after it was requested, it just showed up and it took the you know, four steps to put together and all of a sudden I was sitting on a cloud. It's quite literally too fancy for me. It has LED lights I haven't even plugged in yet. It could look a lot cooler than it does. So if you want to check out all this stuff at a discount, the link is in the description, not only to this awesome chair that I've been using, but also to all of the different home goods that Costaway can get to you in like a day, day and a half. I cannot recommend it highly enough. It's fantastic stuff. And so are these goals. Has to be big old Nicholas Vecchi, does it? Does it have to be? It really what starts this is the beautiful run from midfield. Oh, that's a sensational goal. I don't think it's taking the puss kiss, but that's a sensational goal. What it also is prompting is a further conversation about how to record things on your computer. OBS is completely free. You download OBS here. Let me do it. Because if I have to watch one more video where people are recording this stuff with their phones, I'm gonna lose it. You download OBS, you create one scene and you create a display capture. You make sure it fits the screen and all of a sudden you're recording mint quality instead of recording your legs in the background. Now, granted, Fion, nice legs, but also good. It drained my battery. Well, we've got to see what happened here. Sosa. Sosa. Oh, he's playing to the end of the... Oh, what a goal! Yeah, that's okay. So it seems like this is an archetype of goal that scored in Football Manager. Just the absolute banger from outside the box where it just almost looks not realistic. I am still right now waiting for the one that not that, that is significantly better than all the others and deserves it. Even Usyk, need I say more? No way. There is. Oh, I did not know that was possible. I did not know that was possible in the game. That is unbelievable. Did you know that was possible? That is a one in a million. Wow, I would be so mad if I gave that up. All right, we're watching this next one in slow motion, which is, which is painful. That's particularly nasty. That's particularly nasty because it's contested at the edge of the box when this ball is hit. That is contested and still converts. Oh, it's Huckleberry. How you doing, dude? Zefik from f***ing miles away. That is in the stanchion. That is top f***ing bins and I mean, compared to like the best goals we've ever seen on Football Manager, it's pretty straightforward. That's still an absolute banger and I'm jumping out of my chair if that happens on stream. Yusuf Fafana, people. One. I do have to show you this one because I think it will end up being goal of the season at the end of the year. 
and you deserve to see this. If ever a goal needed a second viewing, it's this one. I do have to show you this one because I think it will end up being goal of the season at the end of the year, and you deserve to see this. No goal way. A second. I mean, it's so like it's an easy goal to score, but it's so absolutely, utterly disgusting. The back heel chip. I mean, just, do, do you get the puskis for that? For just going so far over the top? I feel like you should. I feel like you should. I feel like that might be the favorite. Champions League last 16, second leg down to 10 men. Okay, this is going to be wild. Oh, we've got in game sound. Somebody after my own heart. That's, I mean, it's a really good goal. What about this one? This one, sir. Okay, we're watching. Oh, lovely ball movement. Lovely ball movement. Clean, precise. Wow. So this is, this is like the Arsenal style submission for the Puskas winner. This is just beautiful, beautiful football. This is scintillating football here. One, two, three. And they just... I mean, I really like that one. I really like that goal's really good. That goal is really good. Somebody said, if you want to see the starting goalie for the 2036 German national team, dive at a stationary ball four times in a row before conceding. Boy, do I have just the thing for you. That sounds exactly like what I want to watch, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, no. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, no. Okay. All right. All right. Somebody said, finally, a bicycle kick goal. Th this is what we've been waiting for. We've always wondered. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. That, that has to win it. Oh, come on. From that deep? I mean, it's a halfway line ball. He's got his sizes. Come on. That's the sickest goal I've ever seen on Football Manager. I don't think it's particularly close. We've seen a lot of absolutely nasty goals. There really hasn't, you know, outside of the funny ones. There really hasn't been one that didn't deserve to be here. But this is, this is the best goal I've ever seen on Football Manager. That is stupid. That is stupid. We're, it, it, it's over. It's over. The Puskas Award winner. The Puskas Award winner is Irziad Rashid. I don't know if it was Irziad Rashid that posted it, but Seattle Solo from the Football Manager Reddit is the person that initially posted this. And Wilson, the goal scorer, absolute utter filth. That is insane. And the best goal I've ever seen on Football Manager. That is insane. That is absolutely insane from James Wilson. Deserved winner of the award. If you want to watch the funniest clips ever on Football Manager, we've done that as well. And just keep the good times rolling. It's YouTube. Also, subscribe, like the video if you had a good time today. Really appreciate it.